Hello everyone, this is Mike Sangvi from Vlama.com and I am back with another video. And in this video, we are going to learn about how to import hot and set box in Oracle VM Virtual Box. The prerequisite for this video or for this exercise, uh, the first one is the Oracle Virtual Box is installed in your machine, and the next thing is you required um, you required hot and work sandbox dot OVL file. Uh, it is not mandatory the version uh, of Hot and Sandbox. You have to just check the prerequisite on Hot and Sandbox or Hot and website for the prerequisite to import this. For example, uh, right now Hot and Sandbox 2.2 .2 is available for download, and for 2.2, .2, the minimum version of Virtual Box is required 4.2. And for us, uh, or for me, it is version 4.3.24. So I am able to import hot and sandbox dot OVF file version 2.2. But in this video, we are going to import hot and work sandbox 2.1 dot OVF file. Okay, so let's start. Uh, first, you have to open virtual box and then click on file and import appliance. Control plus I is the shortcut. So press Control plus I from your keyboard, and this is the import virtual appliances wizard. Okay. Once more, click on File and Import Appliances. Next thing you have to select the path where your .ovr file is available. For me, it is available inside F Data VM. So I'm going to copy this path, and then next thing we are going to open this in our Please choose virtual appliances file to import. Click on open to open the folder and finally it's time to select our .ova file. Click on open and next thing we have to click on the next button. Now finally uh, I want to change some settings, some default settings. So the default setting the RAM size is uh, RAM size is assigned for our virtual or guest OS is 4 GB. And in my system or in my laptop, only 4 GB physical RAM is available. So I want to reduce the RAM to 1.5 GB or let's say 1500 MB, approx. And I want to change the directory for my hot and sandbox 2.1 disk. And I want to select the F drive. The reason is because my C drive is not contain enough space. So I want to create this virtual machine in my F drive. And this is the path. So let me copy this path. And then we need to paste the path here. Replace this path with your required path. And if you have enough space in C drive, no need to change it. Okay. Now we are ready to import and click on import and finally VirtualBox is importing our Hortonworks Sandbox virtual machine. So we have to wait, it will take some time. Uh, for me it is showing 11 minutes remaining. So I am going to pause my video and I am back once it is done. And finally our sandbox is imported successfully and now we are going to start our hot and work sandbox so select your hot and work sandbox and click on start so it will take some time to start the first uh, virtual machine uh, virtual box is going to start the VM and then our VM is going to be boot or the Linux OS is going to be boot and then finally the OS is going to start all the services one by one. So it will take some time. So here is setting hostname sandbox.control hotworks.com and setting logic volume management check file system blah 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 starting the port server starting system logger, starting tutorials, starting system messages, bus, starting or mounting file system and so on. So finally uh, starting SNMPD, starting SSHD, uh, 
and start updating IP, starting HDP, starting MySQL. Okay, and in this, if you are getting any warning message, just ignore. I'm going to pause my video and I'm back once my all the services started and my hot and sandbox is finally we are able to use it properly okay uh, finally our hot and sandbox is started successfully and now uh, we want to open this link http 127.0.0.1 and port number is 8888 so let me open this in my internet explorer and because of this machine my system is very slow because out of 4 GB uh, let's say I think 1.5 GB is used by my OS and the remaining 1.5 GB we are located on of uh, allocated for this VM so let me open this so I want to open HTTP colon and what is uh, 127 127.0.0.1 and 4 time adds ok so we have to wait okay. uh, in internet explorer inside the address bar type http uh, HTTP colon 127.0.0.1 and the port is 4 time adds. ok this is the registration form and another link I want to share with you is you have to type the same link but this time I want the port is 800 okay and if you are not able to access this link then you have to uh, just disable your firewall or any internet security so right now my silent mode uh, enable uh, my smart smart firewall is disabled my antivirus or auto protection is disabled so i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, we have to wait for this link it is still opening so this is our final uh, dashboard of uh, work area or web page where we can access all the available tools in our hot and sandbox. So this is PVX, this is Pig, Edge Catalog, File Browser, Job Browser, Job Designer, OZ Editor, Use Shell, User Admin and Help. And in our future videos or upcoming videos, we are going to learn about lots of things about big data concept. We are going to learn about Hadoop. We are going to learn about the file system HDFS. We are going to learn about Edgebase, Hive, Mahout, Peak, Zookeeper, OZ, Impala, and lots of stuff. So don't forget to click on subscribe button. Just give a thumb up and feel free to share with your friends. Leave your comments and see you guys in the next video on big data tutorial